So in this video, we're going to do something kind of exciting. I've never done this before. Um, I'm going to show you. So I have, oh, the glare though. Let's try that. Okay. So I have this as well as this. And if you don't know what these are, I'll explain. Um, in Japan, every year on New Year's Day, January 1st, they release something called a Fukubukuro, and I'm pretty sure I butchered that word, but essentially what it is, it's a lucky bag. So stores will create these lucky bags and they'll put them for sale for a set price and essentially the items inside are mystery and you're supposed to get double the value that you spend on it. So I got two, which is very difficult to do. I live in the United States. Um, I had to go through a shopping service on Instagram. I'd never used them before, but it went really great and it got here really fast. So I'm going to link them down below. I would definitely recommend ordering from them if you want some Japanese goods. It's kind of a struggle to get those here. Um, that's what I used. So I'm going to open one in this video and then one in another video because I have two here. Both Disney ones because this one, the small purple one, this one's from the Disney store. The Disney store released two. There was a red one and a purple one. This one was the smaller one. It was a little bit cheaper and then the Disney one was more expensive. Um, I mean the Disney one, the red one was more expensive. Um, so I wanted to get this one, but I didn't, I follow two shopping services on Instagram and I accidentally emailed the wrong one trying to get this one. Um, and they were like, we're not doing lucky bags. And I was like, oh, I'm sorry. I thought I emailed this one. So then I had to email them and then they were going to see if they had any more available because, um, it was the next day and luckily they did. So I got one of these, but before I knew that they had one of those available, um, at another store, they were selling these, and these are like Disney princess ones. I'm pretty sure it's licensed, not 100%. Uh, I guess we'll find out. I'll be able to tell on the items. It'll have like a licensing on the back, but this is genuine Disney stuff. This is the one I'm actually most excited about. I don't know what's in either of these. It's a complete mystery, so we're going to go through this together, um, but I'm going to open this one in this video, and then the next one I'll do the princess ones, and then we can like compare, see which one was better, so... We're gonna do this one. So most of them, yeah, I didn't bring scissors. Most of them are sealed like this. They have a little tag so you can't open the zipper and see what's inside. Um, my pink princess one doesn't have that seal anymore because in packing from the shopping service, they opened that one to put this inside to kind of consolidate, but I still haven't looked inside. I made my husband go in and grab this out and then close it back up. So it's still a mystery to me but this one is still sealed so we're gonna go ahead and pop that open hopefully i can do this with group strength okay that wasn't that hard that was easy not the strongest so was slightly concerned um i really liked this one because i liked the bag it's just like Minnie mouse it's a cute lavender color um she's on a bunch of hearts and then the other side is daisy and then the, they had a red one as well that was a bigger reusable bag like this this is that um reusable kind of canvasy plasticky material and then I think it had like Mickey on it or something. Um, but I was hoping since this is more like pastel-y lighter colors, this might be more kind of girlier aesthetic, maybe. Um, so I guess we'll see. So I took the thing off. It's the backwards. Let's go inside. So I'm not gonna look in the bag. I'm just gonna grab and then we'll see what we get. So open. The first thing I got is something soft. I'm gonna put this down here. <gasps> Cute! oh okay so this is the first thing um if you don't stock disney 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 japan like i do um they have this line called university and what they do is they create disney characters in like teddy bear form so like this so they'll have they they did like a monsters monsters university one where it was like a big teddy bear he was blue and he had spots and it was sully and then they had like a small green one and it was mike and things like that so it's teddy bear form but they're like disney characters so this one oh i don't know who this is because i've never seen this oh no okay well i'll post here after i look into it um, what character this one is supposed to be, but this is one of the ones where like you can clip it onto your bag or oops, onto your bag or like if you live in an area where you have train tickets on your um, pass case and things like that, but it also has a clip so you can like, let me 
can you see that okay it has a clip so you could like clip it onto your outfit or onto your bag or something like that as well it's really cute it's this really cute like corally peach color with a pink bow and then another pink bow back here and then brown tan tail and brown ears but I'm not 100% sure looking at it what character this is supposed to be so I'll have to look into it but I'll post it right here so you guys know um what I'm also gonna do is I'm gonna post the price of each item I had to think about that the price of each item that's in the bag if it has a price tag and then we'll total it up versus the price that I spent so like the total value will be next to the value I paid for it. So we'll get to see if it was actually worth it. And then I'll also tell you how much each item would have been individually. So this one right here, this cute little university keychain, he was, or she was, um, 1,800 yen, which is about 18 US dollars. The conversion rate is really easy. You kind of just move the comma over one and that's what your, what your US dollar amount will be. So this one was 18 US dollars, um, 1,800 yen. And then the next one, let's see. Cute! Oh, this is cute! Okay, this is uh, like deco tape, like washi tape, in one of those dispensers, kind of like um, whiteout comes in, and it's stitched. And then you can see on the top what the pattern's gonna be. So it's three different stitch designs with um, some like florals and leaves. Um, very like Hawaiian motifs. These are actually really cute. I love this. So this you can just use to like decorate any kind of like letters if you send those or if you have like a journal or like a planner, you can use this in that as well. Um, my husband loves stitch. So I'm definitely going to use this everywhere in the house and see if it annoys him or if he loves it. This itself was uh, 400 yen, so $4. Next, let me get this thing. It's soft and plush. It's a towel! This is cute! Oh, let's see if I can figure out how to open it. Okay, it's right there. Struggling. So this is a towel with Mickey and Minnie. So you've got Mickey, Minnie with a red bow, and then a red Mickey. And then um, a different Minnie Mouse face. They're actually all different faces, it looks like, because you've got this one where he's it looks like he's got all both of his eyes closed, which is really cute. So it looks like this and then you just unfold it like that and it's very long let's see if I can get it all yes okay I am tall enough so this is really cute I'll definitely use this in my bathroom Ooh, or my kitchen that'd be cute too um I love Disney themed everything obviously so this will definitely go in handy that was I have no idea it doesn't have a price mystery um I don't even know how to guess. I'll try and look up online to see what like almost like dish towels like this would go for so we can do like a general price maybe. Who knows? Okay, next thing. We'll do this one. Oh, cute! Okay, so this is one of those pass cases that I was talking about. So it has a little pocket right here where you would actually put um, like your train ticket or your bus card or something like that. And then when you go to get on, you'll just have, you just put that against it and it'll like buzz you in. But then it's got Belle on the one side and she's so cute. She's all like pastel colored. You've got Mrs. Potts and Chip right there, the rose, and then an open book. I was trying to make sure that there weren't any other characters. And then it has this clip right here. So it'll clip onto your bag and then a bungee cord. So it'll be easy for you to like reach it over to the scanner. This is really cute. Belle's not my favorite princess um, right now because it changes a lot. Right now it's Cinderella and Aurora. They're my favorite princesses, but um, this is really cute and I'll still use it. And it was 500 yen, so $5 for this. I don't remember how much this bag was in total. I'll have to look. I think this is washi tape. That's what it feels like. It is definitely washi tape. Okay, this was 400 yen and it looks like... One day Okay, this is cute. So this is like calendar washi tape. Oh, it's gonna be hard to show this without the glare, without taking the wrapping off. And I don't know how to take this wrapping off. Struggle. Eh, nope, that's not gonna work. Okay, uh, we'll do our best. So it's got days of the week on the top, like Monday through Sunday. And then it has the Fab Five, what looks like the Fab Five around the bottom. So far, I've only seen Mickey, Goofy, and Donald, so that might be it. 
the fab three then um but then on the top it has your days so you could easily use this in like a journal to um kind of help you schedule out your days of the week what to do this is really cute this will come in handy i do have like a planner but i tend to write too much in a square and run out of space so this would be nice because i can just pop it in a corner and like add extra notes of things that i need to do for that day so that's really good okay there's just two more things in here i think so one is i don't know what this is this was 200 yen so two us dollars it's got donald's face on it is this like a marker what is this i think this is a mark this is totally a marker that's interesting so they sell these individually i guess i've seen these before but they always came in a pack huh so we got a blue marker that's got donald's face on it um this was like i said 200 yen so two dollars last thing yes yes okay last thing is a pen oh it's an ursula pen it's a villain pen this is actually really like heavy duty this is like metal um this is a good quality pen so we've got ursula's name with tentacle designs going up the pen and then the pen cap has a tentacle on it as well and oh is this not a pen oh it's a pointer stick this is great so i guess it's ursula's tentacle and then you can use it like in class if you're giving a presentation or something where you need to point at um examples point like that this is actually really cool. I like this. Ursula is not my favorite villain, but she's one of my favorite villains because she kind of has the best songs. So this is really cool. I like this. This was 900 yen, so $9. I really like this. So in total, we got the Ursula pointer, the Donald Duck marker, the cute university little keychain. This is definitely my favorite thing that we got. And then the days of the week washi tape the bell pass case which is my second favorite thing that we got because princesses the stitch washi tape dispenser and then the i folded this inside out mickey and minnie dish towel so that's everything we got um i don't know if on the bag it tells me how much the bag was in total but i can definitely look it up at least how much i paid for it um if I can't find how much it actually was if you were actually there to pick it up. But all that, plus you get this really cute reusable tote. So I liked everything in it. I definitely think it was worth it. I do remember that this wasn't that expensive. It was like, I think like $20 or less, maybe 25, but it wasn't too expensive for what everything you get in it. I definitely think it's worth it. I don't think we doubled our investment, unless I don't remember exactly how much I paid for this correctly. Um, but we did definitely get at least the value of it and we got some good stuff. The university bear is my favorite. Oh, I love it. So this one was good. Check out the next video that I'm going to post. It's going to be the one that is the pink princess, uh, Fukubukuro to see what we get in that one. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.